What is up guys, Prodigy here, bringing you guys the first video on the channel regarding the new DLC coming to Destiny called The Rise of the Iron. The reason I'm making this video today is because there was a bunch of leaks that came out regarding this DLC starting off with the release date. The release date for the new DLC coming to Destiny called The Rise of the Iron is coming September 20th, which is almost right there. And it's bringing a bunch of new stuff from new weapons, new armor, a new raid, and a bunch more. You might have seen this picture floating around the internet somewhere by now, but this is what we're getting. Off the back at the beginning, you can see that it tells you, you must have the Taken King to even play this DLC. So for you guys that haven't bought the Taken King, for you guys that don't own the Taken King, you guys will not be playing the Rise of the Iron unless you have the Taken King, which sucks, but it's happening. Next off, we get a small description on the DLC mentioning the new enemy called the Fallen Mutants. And you guys can also see everything else that we're getting below. From the new story, new gear, new raid, new maximum light level, new strike, and more, including a new social place called the Plague Land Zone and a new Crucible game mode with maps. And finally, it tells you that you require 14 gigabytes for this DLC. So make sure you guys have that. And one more picture before we get off this video, which some of you guys probably will get sad from, but there you go. This DLC might be only coming for the Xbox One and PS4. Yep, Xbox One and PS4. 360 and PS3 might be getting cut out from this DLC. That is so they can make a better product for the Xbox One and PS4. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you guys can please leave a like. If you're new to the channel, make subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.